Hey Becky, this is Melinda. So I'm ready to go over your cover with you. And I was looking like, <laughs> I am emotional today, girl. So I have a client who, uh, their book is about the loss of their young child. So, you know, I was just messaging with her. So anyway, I'm very, very, um, I'm just an emotional girl. And that's okay, right? <laughs> I take all that emotion and I put it into my client's projects. And so, um, this is what I've got at this point. And I kind of wanted to wa walk you through the um, what I did, why I did what I did. I did what I did. I said what I said. <laughs> so... Um, I like to be very intentional about everything I do. It's not just like I don't do the throw spaghetti to the wall and see which one sticks. And so I intentionally picked out, I'm going to start with the color palette. So these are the four colors or five if you count the white. And so I wanted something that represented the love. And then I wanted something that represented um, the earth. Um, I read through your, you know, book, and so that's definitely the theme that um, stood out to me, a and it's changed the world, right? So we have changed the world, um, so I wanted something that, you know, again, love and world, and then bring a color palette together that those complemented each other. And then, so I chose this um, nice, rounded serif font called, uh, what is it, Haboro, H-A-B-O-R-O. -O. So I, I source all my fonts from Adobe Fonts so that they're um, commercially licensed and um, can be packaged with the product, with the project. And then I noticed how you, throughout your manuscript, kept italicizing because. You would do love because. So I wanted to implement that in the cover design as well. So I have love in regular and then because in italics. And then um, how to change the world one blessing at a time. And then Becky Kopitsky at the bottom. And then what I've done, because reading your book and seeing why, you know, how you gave the description of what is a blessing, I chose this pattern right here. I like, I'm not a fan of doing a completely white background. I mean, it looks great on a dust jacket, a wrap, you know, that wraps, but on a paperback, I don't, do I, I don't even know if I have any solid white ones. Sorry, not trying to turn my back to you. <laughs> Just, um, yeah, I don't even have any solid white ones that, what about this? No, that's not it either. Okay, so um, one thing that I look to do when I'm designing covers is I'm looking for elements that we can use throughout the marketing campaign of your book. And for the background, uh, this particular instance is subtle. You know, I know you wanted a white background, but this gives it just a little bit of texture. And let me make this bigger. You can see it's fish and birds, see? So it's a fish and bird pattern, like you're, like the fifth day. So, I thought that was pretty cool that I was um, able to locate. So, I, I, mean, I spent a lot of time just going through the stock photography, color palettes, font selection before I ever get to this point. So, a lot of thought has gone into this. You can see how the cover looks next to, here are the other covers you selected. Um, or, you know, somewhere your shared shelf space, somewhere your personal preference. And then we have over here... You, your uh, the covers at thumbnail size, your previous cover, and then um, the current cover for the retitling. So at this point, I just need you to let me know like what you, if you want anything adjusted, 
And like, I actually have a form that um, I'll send you that's going to say like, I love it just like it is. Don't change a thing. And uh, then you'll, another option is it's very close, but I would like for you to change this. And another option that is like, what were you thinking? I hate this <laughs> or something like that. I don't think it's exactly that, but it's something <laughs> along those, uh, that line. So, okay. So I am going to shut up now <laughs> and, um, we'll send this to you via email and we'll look forward to hearing your thoughts. Okay, goodbye.